Hello everyone, today we are opening up this Innistrad Midnight Hunt bundle. Now with 8 set boosters. So in here we're supposed to get a glow in the dark, spin down life counter, some uh, basic and foil land, and 8, uh, eight 12 card set boosters. And we're getting a traditional foil, um, Triska, <laughs> whatever that is, and a um, card box. So let's crack this open and see what we get. All right. Cool. Um, I really enjoyed opening the other bundle, which was um, the Strixhaven bundle. So we'll see what this Midnight Hunt has. So it looks like we're going down the path of Universal Monsters now. We got our werewolves and we got our vampires. Hmm, interesting. All right. It looks like we have a description of the of the plane. That's interesting. And uh, yeah, werewolves. Werewolf, werewolves. Uh, we got our typical empty box. Just use as a spacer. In the back here, and then we got our card container. And here we have our um, glow in the dark dice. We'll have to charge it under this light until, uh, and then we'll uh, see at the end of the video if it's any good. And again, um, if this is too slow, you can always skip to the end to see what hits we get. All right, um, we got our guide cards, and we got our regular lands. And we got our foil cards. All right, this is our promo. Let's see what the card looks like. <clears throat> and uh, foil lands are always welcome to just bling out your deck. Um, if you don't already have full art cards for all your lands. Okay, no maximum hand size. Cool. 13 cards to win. So let's just sleeve that up and our foil lands. Man, if Pokemon did this, that would be that'd be pretty cool if they pack some foil land, uh, foil energy in their uh, in their boost in their uh, bundle boxes, in their elite uh, trainer boxes. That would be pretty cool. So here's our eight packs. There's no um, cover art variety in Magic. Interesting. All right, set booster. Let's crack this open. See what we get. We get a clue. That's the behind. That's the back. So in the beginning, we have a art card. Look at that. Looks like some red-eyed. Who are these people? Are they werewolves? Who knows? Dire overlord sounds like a werewolf. And here is our first uh, full art uh, land island. Sweet. Looks pretty cool. With a person right here. Nice, not bad. Candle Grove Witch. All right. Ritual Guardian. Sentry. Purifying Dragon. That's pretty cool. I like dragons. Cathartic Pyre. Nice, nice. Tireless Hauler. Outland Liberator. This is our um, special art card. I like it. I like the border. I like the art style. Very, very nice. And another one. Huh. That's cool. Um, so the I wonder if it's, this is like the D&D set where we're supposed to make like a little story as we progress as bird martyr. Nice, nice. Cool. I really like all these art cards that are in this set. Curse of the Shaken Faith. That is our rare. Okay. And uh, Soul Guide Griff. And that is our foil. Nice. And our clue is our token. Not, not bad. I like... Um, I like all the special art that we get. Um, I do like set boosters for opening and for enjoyment. They're pretty much on par, I think, with a Pokemon pack. And I guess like a collector's booster is equivalent to like a Japanese specialty set. Okay, we got a werewolf with a bunch of smaller regular wolves, I suppose, I think, maybe. And we got another full art land. 
That's pretty cool. Go for dominance. Howl of the hunt. Stuffed bear. That's funny. And then it comes to life <laughs> with two mana. Ghoulish procession. More of an opportunist. Death Bonus Sprout. <laughs> funny. I like mushroom creatures. Harvest Tide Infiltrator. That is sick. Look at this art. Look at this. That's awesome. I love it. Shady Traveler. Man, I really like this art style. This is our rare Vision of Dominance. I wonder if it's any good. Um, Angel Fire Ignition. That is our second rare. Cool. And a Dawn Heart Rejuvenator is our foil. And at the back, we got a Necrotic Sliver. Huh. I haven't seen slivers in a long time. That's pretty cool. We'll put this to the side. And uh, we'll just uh, sleeve these two up. Okay. Wow. It's kind of fun. Um, I think it's the art cards that really do it for me. The, the alternate, the special art cards. Um, they really, uh, I think because they're out of the ordinary, I really like them. And also, I like the I like the line art style as well. It's pretty cool. Okay, next pack. We have some sort of creature. <laughs> what is that? Is that a griffin or something, or a pegasus with tentacle face? Whale drifter. Wow. Okay. Another full art land. Nice. Perfect. Olivia's Midnight Ambush, Mounted Dread Knight, Vampire Interloper, Thermo Alchemist, that's a cool card, Arcane Infusion, not bad, Burly Breaker, Harvest Tide Infiltrator again, cool, Village Watch, nice, that looks like a fun card, and it transforms at, uh, at night time. That is really cool. It's a very interesting mechanic. Candle Girl Witch. Meat Hook Massacre. This <laughs> I see this all the time in Arena. This is probably one of the best cards in the set. And a Lunark Veteran. Wow, this is definitely one of the best cards in the set. And I just pulled it. Um, it's It looks like it's basically a staple in any deck that contains black at all. And I see why. It's super awesome. It's like a board clear with a um, with a special effect for gaining and gaining life and counting down your opponent. Okay, we have a, a jack o' lantern and some person harvest tide sentry. All right, we got another full art land. I'm loving it. Timberland guide. Bramble Armor, Candlelit Cavalry, Dawn Heart Rejuvenator, Necrosynthesis. That's a cool, that's a cool art. Look at that. It's like this tree that's been eating people and like in integrating them into its like physiology. Ah, this is sick. All right. Vivisection. Man, the theme of this is really cool. Reminds me a lot of um, Bloodborne kind of thing. Outland Liberator. Nice. Love it. Dawn Heart Mentor. Really cool. Curse of Leeches. Oh, look at that. <laughs> no. Uh, Thraven Exorcism. And Trade Out Routes. We got a second rare in our special list. Return target land you control to its owner's hand. What's the use of this? Discard a land from your hand. Draw a card. Ah, so late game. You can cycle all your lands. Interesting. That sounds like a pretty cool card, actually. Let's put that back here. And Curse of Leeches, they can hang out with the other rares. Oh yeah, so it transforms, and when it transforms, it turns into a Leeching Lurker. Really cool. All right, we're halfway through. Four more packs to go. Alright, we got some shady dude, Delver of Secrets, collecting bugs, 
Oh yeah, he transforms into a bug, doesn't he? All right, planes. Stuffed bear, perfect, I love it. Candle trap, I see this a lot. Uh, Shadow Beast sighting. Audrex Outrider. Flesh taker. Oof, creepy, look at that human assassin. That is creepy. Sacrifice another creature. Harvest Titan Trader. Look, look at the difference. Look, which is, look, this is like, like a thousand times cooler. I mean, this is not bad, but yeah. Bane Blade Scoundrel. Wow. Look at this art. I love the shadow and turns into, yeah, definitely. <laughs> really, um, yeah, I got that feel. All right, Legendary Angel. Look at this, it's just completely black and white. Wow, really love the art. And another mythic, Consuming Blob. That is really cool. And a Blinking Observer, which is just an eyeball. See, th see, didn't Bloodborne have a lot of eyeballs? Mm. I really like the theming. Okay, that's really cool. Um, again, Love the love the art style of the of the subset. What do you call this? Or special art? Alt art? Man, really cool. All right, next. Let's see what we have. Um. Some sort of overgrown farmland. That's cool. Mountain. Stuffed bear again. Man, I can make a bear deck. Shadow Beast sighting. Tapping at the window. Really creepy. Defend the Celestis. Cathar's Call. Ecstatic Awakener. Fangblade Brigand. Cool. Burly Breaker. Wake to Slaughter. That's cool. That's our rare. And we got a Soul Guide Griff as our Hollow. And we got a Wolf Token. I bet that will become very useful in this set. I'm sure there, uh, since it's such a werewolf themed um, and werewolf hunter themed set, that uh, I'm sure there's plenty of ways to generate Wolf Tokens. Next pack. Let's see what we get. We got some sort of Priest Hunter. Celestis Sanctifier, Folar Swamp, love, love the art, Might of the Old Ways, Clarion Cathars, Search Party Captain, Corpse Cobble, Spill Blade Stitch Scab, Vengeful Strangler, Tireless Hauler, Spell Rune Painter, and turns into Spell Rune Howler. Creepy. Dawnheart Rejuvenator. Our rare is Slaughter Specialist. Very cool. Every time your opponent loses a person. Uh, Thermo Alchemist. This is a really cool card, especially for aggro decks. Definitely one that, um, because it does the one damage to each opponent. Or not aggro, I meant, um, like burn decks. So, because it got, has to untap and tap for damage. Really interesting. And a zombie. Um, I think there's a really strong zombie theming in this uh, set as well. So I think that's definitely another one that's very useful. All right. Let's see what we get. Let's pack magic. We already pulled a couple um, mythics already, so I'm not expecting much. But, you know, who knows? Maybe we'll get lucky. Okay. Field of Ruin. Yeah. Forest. Tapping at the window, Startle, Unblinking Observer, Component Collector, wait, see another eyeball guy just like the Unblinking Observer, look, eyeball party, Ritual of Hope, Join the Dance, Create some Human Tokens, Shady Traveler, who is this mysterious person, Stalking Predator. Menace, 4-4 four, four Menace, 4-3 four, Mana, Spell Rune Painter, turns into Spell Rune Howler, Shady Traveler again, 
but again like the superior art oh look at that that is sick Geist Flame Reservoir and another mythic look at that Lear Disciple of the Drowned every spell has flashback man this is a sick card and uh, Karu at two mana that's interesting but like this is a this is <laughs> it's a really annoying card to play against that's for sure all right let's uh sleeve these up but we got a foil mythic very cool all right let's do a recap of our pulls okay let's uh look at our mythics first all right, we got Meat Hook Massacre, uh, one of the best cards in the set. Consuming Blob, I haven't seen this, but maybe it'd be fun to use. And Lear, Disciple of the Drowned, I've seen this quite a bit. Um, Geist Flame Reservoir, Slaughter Specialist, could be good fun for a fun deck. Wake to Slaughter, uh, Lisa, Forgotten Angel, Curse of Leeches, Vision of Dominance, Angel Fire Ignition, Curse of Shaken Faith, um, Tris Triskaidophile? <laughs> Triskaidekaphile. Is that someone who likes the number 13? I think that's what it means. <laughs> and we got um, extra cards from the list. We got Karu, which is not bad. Add two mana. Trade Routes. Late Game Cycling. And Necrotic Sliver. Alright. Um, and last thing. Is this, is this Glow in the Dark? Is this going to the dark, everyone? Hard to tell. Maybe. Maybe it just needs actual natural sunlight. But that's all we have. Uh, thank you, everyone. I'll catch you later. Goodbye.